I'm going to share with you how to add YouTube videos into Anki. I'm studying mechanical engineering and there's times where I have absolutely no clue. So I have to watch like 10 YouTube videos until it clicks. And then when I find that one YouTube video, I put it into Anki. And when I come back to it in a month, I can just watch that YouTube video and I just understand it so much quicker and it's brilliant. So I hope this video helps you um, understand it better and let's get into showing you how. Right, get your Anki open. Um, you can download it easily off the internet somewhere. It's free, which is incredible. With Anki, thing like this. That's that thing is called rectangle. It's like an app where you can just like easily bounce it to the right and left. I love using it as split screen because it makes my life a hell of a lot easier. Say I was doing thermodynamics like I did this year. Let's say by the laws of thermodynamics. What is the first law of thermodynamics? Okay. I would go in here. Sometimes they, so this is the main equation, so I would copy. I use this thing called Command D, copy and paste images over, which really helps me. And say I still didn't understand this equation, I would go over to YouTube. Um, I use this Chrome extension called DFTube, which allows you to like remove all related videos so you don't get distracted. So I would add that into there. And uh, he's brilliant, organic chemistry tutor. So. I watched this video, so if I wanted to get that definition that he just said there, energy cannot be created or destroyed, it can only be transferred from one source to another. So if I wanted this bit here and like a couple of these diagrams and just watch that video, say I liked his explanation of this like box and I wanted to start the video from here. I'm now going to show you how to add it into Anki. So you press this share button, press embed, and you, because I stopped it at 41, I can start it at 41 because I do that with all the videos because you kind of want to cut out the intro within watching like a YouTube video because nonsense. That's so you're saving yourself time. Um, so I copy that and then I go over to here. You need to click this button here and then paste it in. Or you can click this button by doing Command Shift X on the Mac. This is my MacBook. So Command Shift X pull up and down it. And then you just press Command V, and then it's in there. What's so cool about it is that when you watch it now, one, it has no ads, um, it has absolutely no ads, which is absolutely incredible, and it can start it at that point. So, say I get stuck on this question and I can't explain it properly, I can't write down the concepts, I can't prove it right, I don't have some sort of example to help me remember it. I would put it in here to help me memorize it. Most of the time, I actually add the YouTube video, let's just take it back here. I actually add it into this extra bar. I'll show you why. I just add that into there for a second. I'll show you why. I put in extra because I've made my own card type. Because when I go through flashcards, I kind of only want to see the essential stuff I need to memorize. So for example, this year for my mechanical engineering degree, this was like one of the main equations in Thermo. I just need to memorize it. But the main thing with Anki, my advice is just keep it very simple. Give me a comment, um, give me a subscribe and a like, it always helps. And um, I hope you have a beautiful rest of your week. Thank you very much.